Hi, I'm Ryan from Aquacut, and in this video, we are going to run through the process of water jet cutting. Water jet cutting is at the heart of what we do here at Aquacut, and it's often the first process for creating complex shapes. Around 70% of what we do is porcelain, 20% is stone, and 10% is metals and plastics. Aquacut has decades of experience with functional and attractive building finishes, which are installed here in the UK and around the world. Water jet cutting gives you a clean cut top and bottom, and with it being a cold process, there is no danger of the heat affection zone. So this is particularly important with your metals, so you don't get any discoloration from the cutting. Our water jet machines are controlled by CNC, so you can use these for complex designs and for your very fine tolerances. We have a tolerance of plus 0.5 and minus 0.5, and you can see some of these designs on screen now. Let me take you through the processes and how we achieve these services. start the water jet process. Our CAD designers have to get all the files ready and sent over to us here at the water jet cutting facility. Now once they're here we'll read over the job cards, make sure we understand all the requirements and look over any drawings that may have been sent with it. We'll then load it into the software here and look over it on our, one of our free water jet machines. Now once it's loaded up we'll do a little trial run, make sure everything's all great and then we will start the full job. Now, once we've finished our uh, trial run, we'll start the job. And once we finish the first cut, we'll always measure to make sure the measurements are correct. And then after that, it will be every other piece that we cut, we will measure to make sure there's no differences between each piece. Whilst we're doing the job, we'll make sure the tiles are packed to the highest possible standard to avoid any breakages, chips or cracks during transit. And to do this, we'll make sure we pack it lots with some foam, some polyfoam, and if needs be, we'll make a nice frame to go around the tiles so it doesn't rattle during transit. 